I'm actually not a bad actor if you think about it. Like, my first time, this this movie, like a high quality production, I'm actually a decent actor. What, what do you think? I think it came through in this scene. <laughs> if you want, come on, tell me. You are so much to me right now. So I think the, the kids are safe around you. I don't think the kids are safe around you. I'm not trying to be self-centered. Like, I'm trying to think of you because you really inspired me for this role, but I think my acting was actually quite good. You know I'm in my 40s, right? If you weren't such a stud, I'd break up with you right now. I tried my best. I put my soul into that. I wasn't the first choice, but I was the choice they went with. You were always looking for direction. I could see it from the start. That day, Sydney Harbour. It was crazy. I was on that ferry and I was like, the ocean. It's calm, but it's telling a story at the same time. The waves, they're, they're speaking to me. I got off the ferry, it was the train. The train's only got one direction. As much as it can switch, it's predetermined. It's on a route. I didn't know what I was getting into. And you didn't either. I looked at you, you looked at me. I don't know, it felt right. I wanted an adventure. You offered one to me. As much as it felt like we were going nowhere, the train gave us direction. I'm not from Sydney. It took us home. It took us to my home. It took you to where I belong. As much as we're in no man's land, because it's, it doesn't make sense anymore. It's the kids I'm talking about, with your kids. I'm infertile. I, I can't deliver much else. Just a masculine figure. I'm just a masculine figure. Really. To that extent. Really. To that extent. Oh god, I've been needing to go for a while, but just like seeing your, seeing, seeing your reaction. I don't think the kids are safe around you. I am your man, and I'm going to take that man's role. I'm the I breadwinner. I don't, I don't know. I know, I'm you're the my man. I, know, I know you're my man, but you've, you're very, very scary, very, very big, and very, very strong and scary. It's, you knew you were getting into that night. It's just all that you've ever wanted to say is just in nah. between. Yeah. You're not our man. That's you, that. You're just a man. Uh, no. I don't know what you're going They're boys. I don't know what I want you to say. I don't know what anyone wants to say. I just know what has to be, has to be done by them. You want too much. You're too aggressive sometimes. No, get with them. I get tongue tied. I get scared no. to speak up. Get the papers. I, Never me. I just don't know anymore. Like, if it's gonna happen, it's gonna happen. But I, I just don't think. Yeah. <sighs> You're cheap as chips, you know. <sighs> You're not even sick. But this is what I get. I'm just a masculine figure, 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 figure. Shouldn't waste my time. I'm a goddamn fool. It goes deep. As much as I can't get over you, you could probably get over me. The Scott Experience! Smash that like button and make sure to subscribe, subscribe, subscribe.